Welcome to week four of my Eagles predictions and uh, general Philadelphia sports talk. First comes first, uh, today is actually Saturday. Uh, good luck to my Philadelphia Phillies. You're gonna play against St. Louis. I hope you, you start with a win. Keep on going all the way through, like I said before. Wanna see a parade down on Broad Street for you guys. Wanna see one in red. Now, back to talking about the Eagles. I told you guys last week not to get too overconfident. Uh, the Giants flat out beat us. Uh, it's a divisional game. We had a lot of talent, people got hurt. They didn't have a lot of talent. They played four quarters and they won. They scored more points. One reason why I'm down here by the Ben Franklin Bridge, when you lose to a team like the Giants, it makes you want to jump off one of these things, right? But as Eagles fans, as we said last week, there's no bandwagon, there's no jumping on or off. We're in it, win or lose, and all the way through the end. Now with my picks, I'm, I'm one and two right now. Of course, because the Eagles are one and two, because I'm never gonna predict that they're gonna lose. But uh, you know, we gotta pick it up. Same time, we can't really be down on our team. We can't be down on them for in front of other fans, and you know, let them see us sweat. It's the third game of the season. Third game. The season is a long season, a long way from over. So you know, we'll we'll take our hits and we'll take our lumps. We gotta stick with the Eagles. I don't want to hear all that. Well, we gotta fire Andy Reid. We gotta do this stuff. How many times, as Eagles fans, have we heard this? We have come back, and next thing you know, we're playing the NFC Championship game. So let's support our team, win or loss. All right. Now this week. This week we're playing against the San Francisco 49ers. Uh, they got their bridge, we got ours. We got the Ben Franklin, they got the Golden Gate. So, San Fran fans, come on down, see some history. And this week, it, it's really two things. Two things I'm concerned about with San Fran. You got Vernon Davis, you got, you got Frank Gore. I mean, those are two big guys, they know how to play football. And, you know, we haven't been good against the run. Now this week, the Eagles are gonna swap it up a little bit. Casey Matthews, you're out for right now, no hate. But we're gonna see if Roll can handle things. See if we can handle Vernon Davis. I mean, that's a big, pretty big athletic guy. He's a little bit bigger than actually Roll, but you know, Roll said he's up to the challenge, so you know, let's see what you got. Casey, you know, get back in the books, get good. You're still a rookie, so you got to play any time. You got to play any time. Grow up in the NFL, and this isn't it. I know you probably heard a lot of stuff on the internet. Block that out. Stay positive. Keep working, Casey. All right, get back in. But for Roll, Roll right now, we're backing you. All right, so let's get up in the lineup. Let's make a difference. Let's not just be a warm body in the lineup. Let's make a difference on defense, all right? That's where we're getting hit really hard. Offense, we've been kind of producing a little bit. You know, we had a hard time in the red zone last week, but we've been producing points. But our defense, we need to stop somebody's offense. All right, we couldn't stop the Giants. We couldn't stop Atlanta. And until Steven Jackson got hurt for week one, we couldn't stop St. Louis. So now we need to step it up, keep a team underneath 20 points so we have a chance to win. So this week, uh, I'm looking for Mike Vick to get back, get back healthy. I hope your hand feels a lot better. You got a nice little glove on that. Shady McCoy, you've been tearing it up all season. Keep tearing it up. I appreciate that. You know, that's that's good running back. We can't ask for anything better. Real shifty, just keep on producing. 100-yard games, you're second in the league right now. That's awesome. So Mike Vick, come on back. And Macklin, I want to see you keep, you're keep on uh, leading our team. Jackson, where are you at? I want to see a more production from Jackson and also from our tight ends, all right? Brent Selleck, you have great hands. I want to see him this week. Jason Avant, possession receiver, third down receiver. I want to see that this week, all right? So let's do it for our team. Let's do our team proud. Let's do our city proud, all right? Phillies, you lead the way. You lead today with a win. Eagles, you follow tomorrow with another win, all right? So down here by the Ben Franklin Bridge, let's do it for our Eagles. And last but not least, as we always do every week, win or lose, E-A-G-L-E-S, Eagles! Come on, baby. Let's do this. Woo! Fly, Eagles, fly. On the road to victory. E-A-G-L-E-S, Eagles! What is this? You know, in all my excitement and trying to boost up the Eagles again, you know, I forgot to do my pick. So, uh, I'm going to do my pick. I think the Eagles are going to win, of course. I'm going to do that. Um, but I'm going to pick 20 to 13. I think our defense is going to hold. And I think uh, we're going to have a score, another one by Shady McCoy. And somebody else, I'm going to, I'm going to pick a Vic. You're going to run it into the end zone. We're going to stop our goal line uh, kind of deficiency. So I'm going to pick a 20 to 13 win by my Philadelphia Eagles tomorrow, 1 o'clock at the link. We can't go three losses in a row. And we can't go two losses at home, all right? So let's do this, guys. 2013, go birds.